friends now it is the time for time management techniques for cbse class 10 mathematics paper since the final exams are in the next month the allotted time for the exam is 3 hours plus 15 minutes 3 hours to solve the question paper and 15 minutes to fill up the information on the answer sheet and to read the question paper. Utilize this 15 minute for this purpose only. As soon as you get the question paper and answer sheet, fill up the information on the answer sheet. Then start reading the question paper. And first of all, read the given general instructions. Check what instructions are given and follow it. Once you went through the instructions, you will find that there it is mentioned that there are 31 questions in all. So first check whether there are 31 questions in all in your question paper or not. Then you will find that the paper is divided into four sections. Section A consists of four sections, four marks. It means each question for one mark. Section B, six questions, 12 marks. It means each question, two marks. Section C, 10 questions, 30 marks. It means each question, three marks. And section D, 11 questions, 44 marks. It means each question 4 mark. Now check all these things whether it is in your question paper or not. Then start reading the question paper once, twice and tick mark those questions which you can solve confidently. And first attempt all that questions which you can solve confidently. Now we will see about the time management. Here in all there are 90 marks and total 3 hours it means 180 minutes. 90 marks and you have got 180 minutes. It means 90 to the 180 it means 2 minute per mark. But if you solve with this speed 2 minute per mark then you will not get time to recheck or revise your answer sheet. Then how it, much time should be there to recheck your answer paper or revise your answer paper and to do the correction if there is any mistake. As far as I am concerned, I will suggest you that you should get 15 minutes at least to recheck and revise your answer paper. So you will require 15 minutes to recheck your paper and do the correction. Now how much time left with you? 180 minutes minus 15 minutes that is 165 minutes that is left with you. So you have to solve your question paper in 165 minutes so that you will get 15 minutes to recheck your paper answer paper because rechecking is must Person to person, this technique may change. You can also devise your own technique according to your comfort. But still, I am giving you how to manage your time according to the section. The first section is section A and the number of questions are 4. And you should take at least 7 minutes for it. Then the section B has six questions. You can consume 20 minutes, 22 minutes for section B. Then section C has 10 questions and you can consume 56 minutes for section C. And section D, there are 11 questions and you can consume 80 minutes for it and the remaining 15 minutes 
you can consume for rechecking time and in all the total time will be 180 minutes this is the technique i have given this is the division per section of time i have given you can change it according to your comfort also there is no problem but you should spare 15 minutes to recheck your answer paper now one month is left for examination start your practice of solving paper with time management take sample question papers sit for three hours and solve complete question paper by sitting for three hours then you can assess yourself on the following grading if you finish your question paper in 138 minutes it's brilliant very well prepared but you might have solved the questions hurriedly because you are saving too much time so to secure 100 percent mark hurry should not be there you should solve cautiously but with time management if you consume 175 minutes to solve the question paper then you are average at time management and you need more practice to increase the speed and if you solve it in 165 minutes then it is excellent well prepared but still needs to revise thoroughly so as to score 100 percent because you are getting 15 minutes to recheck your question answer paper while rechecking if you find any mistake correct it there and there only this is the time management tactic that you can use during your examination during your practice session and you can check yourself you can assess yourself or you can even devise your own technique thank you very much for watching this video if you have liked it share it with your friends subscribe to the channel because subscribing to the channel you will get all updates right into your mailbox and to sharing it with your friends they too will understand the time management techniques thank you very much Friends, you might have enjoyed this video, then go to thumbs up button and click. Then go to share tab and share with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus and many more. And to get the updates right in your mailbox, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much.